Yo, what is up, guys? I am back. It's me, Liam, back with another video. And and this video, I'm I'm doing a scratch tutorial, and I'm going to be showing you how to make a a, a character customizer game. Uh, uh, it, 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 in Scratch. So you can tap different parts of your character to make it look different. And um, yeah, you can also switch the background. I just made a witch. I just made a, made a witch donut. So yeah, I'm going to be showing you how to make one of those. So uh, let me just go to see see inside. And as you can see, how I did it is 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 first. Let's get first. Let's do first. Let's like do all do all the stuff with the costumes. So look, we have donut. We I I I I, made, I we have the donut here, and, and I made a. Each, I made a sprite. I made a. I separated the donut into into three sprites: the donut, the frosting, and the hole, like the little hole that's in the middle of the donut. <laughs> so um yeah. So but first, if you want to have different options for the costume, you you just pick which sprite you want to have more cost. You want to have like different options. And then, look, I made multiple, like costumes for for it. So then you can like choose which one you want, and you can and I did that for the frosting. I, I made a hacker, and I did that for a hole. And and so yeah, but if you want to actually code it to make it so when you click it, uh, 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 uh um, it it actually um like, it actually, it it actually. It actually like changes, so so you're just gonna so you're just gonna pick whichever one whichever part you want. You have to do this for each of your uh 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 uh, uh um like parts of your character. So you put when this sprite clicked, next costume. So that makes it so when so when it's clicked, it changes the costume. And I I did that with the frosting. In the hole. So now I'm gonna sh just gonna show you one more thing before we end the video. So I made a b a button that 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 makes it switch the backdrop every time you press it. So what I did. So here's how you do it. You just you draw or let's just pick a bunch of backdrops. I just picked a bunch of these backdrops. I picked all these. But um, yeah, and then you pick all the backdrops, and once you, and then you go to the, to whatever, and you go to the button. I created the costume for the button. I picked the button and to choose a sprite, but then I used the pixel um font and the text to, to 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 to, to like to to write it. But yeah, <laughs> so so then you just put when. You code the button, and you put when this sprite click next backdrop. So instead of next costume, that does next backdrop. So that makes it switch the backdrop every time you click the button. So uh, yeah, and you can and you. And you can, and you don't just have to make a donut. You can make all different. You can make, di you can make a different costume, like maybe a dog, cat, um, or whatever else you can you can imagine. So, um, yeah, I hope I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.